Hey, so I'm back in the doorway for tonight already. I know it's cold already. And the hot water bottle's filled up. Uh, and the food. Shrunk things down a bit tonight. I used to uh, store food somewhere temporarily. Uh, yeah, that's the way it goes. Got to the gym today, obviously. Uh, not a very good workout. I will explain why eventually. Uh, when people decide to actually wake up and hear the truth rather than Sarah and all of us and the other crap comments we keep getting on various videos. You should have a look, really. You should read. So, if you want to lose word up, word is. The reason I haven't got a solicitor is because I'm not afforded one because legal aid is not entitled to them. Someone in my current situation is entitled to. Nor was I entitled to proper procedure by the police. Nor did they actually do anything other than say, well, I haven't actually looked at your evidence. And then actually, you know, which I thought was brilliant because that proves them not doing their job. Now, isn't it interesting how this works? It's funny, I was told by various people that I need to speak to counter terrorism police. Yeah, oh no, I don't really think they're necessary. Oh, right, because you're the one who can look at a laptop and go, oh, well, it's not been happening when it's turned off, which I must admit professionals in the country found most amusing. They themselves want a huge sum of money. So, what I am going to do is have a chat with the MP, which I am told to face to face. Nice little conversation and get him to have a little chat because I've already spoken to various experts and well no actually what we do as a job mainly is actually do stuff that the police don't do because they just don't bother doing their job looking into electronic equipment, hacking or anything else like that because they're so busy, um, I have no idea doing what to do, that's what I really don't. Uh, the local police officer as well as an amazing guy, does a really good job. Um, I know quite a few up and down the country, especially in Cornwall, who looked at certain steps and these aren't even written right Mr Marshall. Um, yeah, if I were you, I'd go back to Hampshire and Stabby and have a little bit of a chat. Which I did, with evidence I was told to get myself and they didn't look at because oh, I asked for a solicitor present when I had the evidence over because that way they'd be made to do their jobs and there'd be a record of it. Which apparently seems to be a real issue for certain people doing their jobs. Unless, of course, it involves them breaking up families and filling their quotas so they get government money because they're basically... Well, it's almost like, what, illegal form of human trafficking, I suppose. Splitting up families and taking away children. Just you hit your quota. Wow, Great Britain. What a country we're becoming, aren't we? And I can't get a solicitor because obviously I've got mental health because I'm now I'm homeless. I have no mental health issues. What I do have is an ex-wife who was apparently not bullied, but apparently did everything she wanted to do, commit criminal offence, etc. Breach her tenancy agreement. The tenancy agreement I added her to as a lead tenant, which was to for my medical move. Which is really been pointed out. Isn't this fun to see how this goes on and on and on? This will not change because these are the actual factual truths. Yeah, but we'll. So this is what talks to you who's crazy. No, so this have spoken to me. Found out I'm not crazy, but I don't have the funding to have them work for me. But what I will have very soon is backing that none of you can understand. And it's not criminal either. Let me explain what is going to happen. There's certain things going to be made public to the media even more so than on YouTube or Facebook. Yeah, now that'll be some fun, won't it? Because it's all true. Now I said. If it turns out to be real, what has been lost? But it is real. It is fact. And little Sarah anonymous keeps asking these questions on Mike video clip. Blah 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 blah. It makes no difference. It really doesn't. All these stupid little questions get asked. You don't believe it. Let's take the uh, evidence and have a look at that properly by professionals. Oh I'm sorry, what well, you don't want to do that because it proves everything I've said and everything about you is what? Criminal, obviously, not saying, but it's not a threat, it's a statement of fact and intent. Only. Simple as that, yeah. Funny, especially done for child abuse, isn't it? What was it I got in an SAR? Evidence of child abuse. What else did I get in an SAR? Get your own evidence. I have, but then the people who are supposed to do with evidence didn't want to look at it. Why? Because then it makes them look incompetent. <laughs> Wow, that's an understatement. It really is. Anyway, yeah, so I'm going to join my doorway tonight. Uh, all the people here backing me 100% because they agree with me. No one's telling the truth. No, I'm not the person I've been painted in the statements, which they've all had been read. Isn't that interesting? So they know who you are. They know the rubbish you said. They know the fact you're liars. You're cheaters. You get involved in drugs, etc. And then blame other people because it has to cover up your backs of what you did. What a shame. What a surprise. Welcome to the real world. This is going to go public. There is no sort of gag order, etc. You wrote these statements about me. The fact they're not true and you can't deal with it is something I'm going to take to the media as I was advised. By, oh, no, London Police, Westminster Police, Counterterrorism Police. Um, I had my day in court by domestic abuse charities. Um, wow, uh, the CAB, I need a criminal solicitor. Um, CPS, various people employed by them. 
be the criminal solicitor Chris not to defend me but to prosecute the people who did this to me and there's a list and it is known it has been recorded has been sent in actual emails to the various people including members of parliament it's going to be fun when it comes out children isn't it what a case like I said I wonder who play me in the movie oh excuse me sorry I should some food um not no I'm not really Matt Damon am I oh well I'll have to look but yeah and it's going to be fun the truth is coming out I'm not being smuggled with I'm just fed up I'm bored I live in the doorway at the moment because people ruined my life because they didn't want to accept the truth. I've proven the truth exponentially and they're still hiding and running because they're too stupid to do the right thing. And it is stupidity. Remember, you're not responsible for everyone else's stupidity, just your own. Yeah? We'll see you soon, won't we? Yeah? I've had enough, so this week I'll push with the media. Bye. And I will post them after I've been to the gym. I'll probably post them on a coffee shop or whatever, you know how it goes. Yeah, well, after all, this is my story, so when my business does start, isn't it going to be interesting? See you soon.